cooler weather doesn't just make us chilly, well, it also affects our wildlife. Yeah, the sea turtles especially. Tonight, one of those turtles, though, has a happy ending for a <laughs> thanks to a hardworking group that brought him back to health. Anytime you watch turtles do this stuff, it's wonderful, you know, and they're the great mysterious animal. We have nicknamed him Frosty uh, because he was a cold stunned sea turtle that was rescued here from our harbor on Alligator Point. We've had warm water, right? And they've been in here inshore and everything else, and then all of a sudden it turns cold, the winds come down, the tide goes out, and a turtle that's even a little bit weak and tired or whatever isn't able to get offshore into the warmer temperatures. So it's in the shallows areas, and then it gets too cold, and then the turtle can't swim. Hey, Frosty. Hey, buddy. He is in really excellent condition. Um, I came and evaluated him and then transported him to Gulf Specimen Marine Lab. We keep them at, uh, try to get them into room temperature first so we don't shock them with warmer water. That could kill them. And then we gradually start heating them up a little bit and then we're able to put them into our tanks and aquariums and spread them around and we try to get them eating if they can. But really, we don't want to keep these turtles very long. We want to get them back into their natural environment. Now see he's smelling the water and hearing the water. You see him start to move. They called and said he's ready to go, so we're going to release him. Oh, watch him perk up. He says, yay! <laughs> Yeah. 